Okay, real quick, I'm going to show you the difference between a raster picture um, or a raster layer and a vector layer. Okay, so um, I used the pen tool, I traced out the Batman logo, and we're just going to zoom out real quick and I'm going to show you in what ends up happening. Okay, so let's say we take both these layers and we want to change their size. There's going to be a difference. The original picture, which is this one, is going to change um, and, and you'll see that it ends up losing quality as we resize it because that is a raster picture, um, which means it has a defined uh, like it has defined like pixels and then as we change those and alter those in Photoshop um, then they kind of get messed up. Now I created a separate layer which is a vector image which um, is basically a mathematical calculation so as we change it all of the um, angles and curve calculations change with it but it's all proportional so it all stays the same so if I take both of these layers and I grab the move tool and I'm gonna select both of them at the same time so that they're the exact same and then I'm gonna hold shift and I'm gonna go ahead and resize this to be much smaller okay um, and then let's go ahead and scoot it over I'll hit enter so both of these are gonna be sized up and let's go um, let's go ahead and do this I'm gonna grab the layer one and I'm gonna go ahead and scoot that over here actually before that let's go ahead and copy these two okay so just in case we want them um, and I've got the copies right there so I'm going to take this layer, I'm going to take my vector layer and scoot it over to the side. Okay, let's turn off these top two layers. So I just have those two original pictures. Let's go ahead and zoom in and take a look at what's going on. So this looks pretty good right now, okay? Um, and you can see that the raster picture um, has got a lot of pixels that are kind of defined, so it's kind of losing some quality, right? Um, and that's this and the vector looks pretty much the same at this point. There's no real big difference, but um, We're gonna see a major difference here in a second So um, I'm gonna turn those two layers off and then I'm gonna turn these two on So this was we shrunk it down and now we had Photoshop interpolate the image So it re-guessed where all the pixels were and made sure everything was all right now if I grab the move tool and then I want to take these two layers that we made a copy of and then increase the size Okay um, then I go back and hit enter you can start seeing that this picture is looking a little fuzzy which is not so good so um, let's go back in and look so let's see what's going on um, right now this is my logo okay now this is returned to about the same size that we were at but because I resized the picture because Photoshop adjusted it um, and now brought it back up it doesn't look so great anymore um, but the vector picture is crisp and sharp um, like again because it's a mathematical calculation so we could take that and blow it up on the side of a billboard and it's going to still look just as sharp um, versus the raster picture which will start to fade and and then programs are gonna have to do a lot of guessing about what pixels are supposed to be where um, and that kind of complicates everything so you have a vector picture easily resizable um, and a raster picture not so much